The yeah. Georgia Legislative Black Caucus wants to help farmers of color become more successful. 41 NBC's Brick Nelson was in Fort Rowlett today as the GLBC visited black owned farms to hear their concerns and the resources they need to keep farming. If it's Georgia grown, we got to support Georgia grown farmers. As part of the Black Farmers Tour, members of the Georgia Legislative Black Caucus are traveling across the southeast to visit black family owned farms and learn how they can support them. Representative Carl Gillard says Georgia has the largest group of black farmers in the nation, but have been left out due to lack of resources. Farmers have been, been crying out, you know, for the very survival. You're talking about generations and generations of farmers uh, that need resources, they need processors, they need uh, revenue, and a lot of times they just haven't been privy to the information. The goal of the Black Farmers Tour is to help get local black farmers the resources they need. We've had a great day um, visiting some of our black farmers so that we can better respond to those gaps that the vice chair was talking about so that we can make sure funding is getting to our black farmers as well. The caucus also mentioned the importance of funding agricultural schools like Fort Valley State University to better educate black farmers. Dean of the Cooperative Extension Program, Dr. Mark Lattimore, says more funding to local black farmers will help fill the food deserts in rural parts of the state. We see this as an opportunity to really build a network, build a base, such that all farmers, whether large or small, but definitely small farmers in Georgia, small African American farmers which we serve, uh, non-African American farmers that are small, can benefit and grow. In Fort Valley, Brick Nelson, 41 NBC News. And after stopping in Fort Valley, members of the caucus held a round table to speak with black farmers about what the state can do to benefit their business.